Hello and welcome to the monthly mystery stream here at 5J Gaming. I'm 5J and today we're going to be opening this bad boy. This box, if you haven't seen my uh, videos on this before, this is a retro game treasure box and uh, that comes from retrogametreasure.com. They send you a box of uh, mystery retro games every month. They've got a variety of consoles ranging from the PS2 era all the way back to Atari 2600. They even have portables like Game Boy and Game Gear. Crazy stuff. Really cool service, and uh, I open these once a month, and uh, I'm excited to check it out. Um, if you're interested in the Retro Game Treasure, uh, you can use the code 5J uh, to get a discount on your subscription. So uh, I'm excited to see what we got in here. See if we got anybody in the chat. Wow, we got a bunch of folks already. We got T here, says, Hello, sorry I wasn't watching your other streams. I was thinking about that YouTube movie stuff. At least I haven't been streaming for a week, man, so I don't think you missed anything. <laughs> Game says, Yay, it's about time! I return to a stream to someone who appreciates my presence instead of... Banning you for saying Harambi? <laughs> oh, boy. That's funny. Hey, Game Boy Toad, what's up, man? Thanks for coming back. And uh, Game Boy Toad and T are chatting to each other. Also, I heard the word Game Boy and I'm here. Still haven't got my RGD. That's eh, fine. Alright, guys. So here's my box. Let's see what we got in here. Feels like there's some junk on top of it. Sorry, it's right in the microphone, isn't it? Alright, ooh, I think I got a Dreamcast game in here. Alright, guys. First game. What is it? Ace Combat Advance. Now, White Ace was just telling me, I think, about uh, Ace Combat. I think he was talking about it on Wii or something, or something. I don't know. I like Flight Sims. I think this is going to be some sort of uh, maybe World War II type shooter or... Actually, that looks like a modern jet engine. Okay, well, it's fighting in the sky. Dog fighting. Sounds cool. Okay. Up next. Feels like it's wrapped still. What is it? Demolition Racer No Exit. <laughs> what? First of all, Demolition Derby, if you've never been to one, Demolition Derbies are awesome. Oh, man. All right, so it looks like there's going to be lots of smashing into each other. <laughs> Sounds good. Infogrames, they're still around, so that's a good sign. If it's a defunct developer, that's not good. Wow, brand new, though. Still wrapped. Uh, Game Boy says, says, bam, Game Boy game. One of three guesses correct. Well, Chris, check out the inside of the box. It's new pixel art. I don't want to read too much about it because I don't want to see what's in there. I'll check the inside after I've found my last game here. T was saying, I think I could get maybe some YouTube people I know in real life, but I don't know. You can see them all on my YouTube channel. I shouted them all out. Nice. Ah, GT says, two of three guesses right. All right. And this last... Oh, oh, there's two! I was fooled! I'm feeling maybe Genesis, maybe Super Nintendo. Let's check, check this one. What is it? Oh, Jurassic Park! I used to play a Jurassic Park um, game as a kid. I remember, like, waiting for the dentist or some random thing. They had a bunch of systems hooked up to a TV in there. One of the games was Jurassic Park. I don't know if it was this one or the Super Nintendo one. But I'm excited. Jurassic Park. Yes. And last, but hopefully not least. What is it? Oh, Super Adventure Island. Nice. Adventure Island was one of those games that I used to play and not get why it was fun at first. 
And then, coming back to it later, and playing it more, I see, I see what was fun about it. And uh, I've never played the Super Nintendo version. I think I played the NES version. I think it was just Adventure Island. So, it'll be cool to see Super Adventure Island. Yeah. Alright, so to recap, guys. We got Ace Combat on the Game Boy Advance. We got Demolition Racer No Exit on Dreamcast. We got Jurassic Park on Genesis. And Super Adventure Island on Super Nintendo. Now normally I play this in the order that I open them, but because I have to get up to get the Dreamcast involved in the stream, I'm going to do this game last. Okay. Also want to check out the inside of this box. Apparently there's new pixel art. Oh, look at that. We got a key from Legend of Zelda, a red potion from the Legend of Zelda, or medicine rather. I don't know that it's uh, some sort of meat, but I don't know what game it's from. We got a red rupee. We got a tetramino. We got a star from uh, Mario. And uh, what is that? It's like a heart container from Legend of Zelda, but I'm not sure which Zelda it would be from. It's not from the NES one. Maybe from uh, Link to the Past Deluxe Edition, maybe? DX? Anyway, guys, RetroGameTreasure.com. If you're interested in a subscription like that, go to RetroGameTreasure.com. Use the code 5J when you check out, and uh, you get a discount. Okay. Let's start with Ace Combat. Also check up with all of my uh, viewers that I have not been reading the chats on. Let's see. Game Boy Toast says, hey, at least you know it's wrapped and it's new and works. It better work. <laughs> Sometimes new games can have uh, issues too. But uh, yeah, a new game is a good deal. And this is what I want. Okay. Uh, game Boy says SNES game. Bam! All three predictions correct. And Chris gets all the cool, popu popularly known games, and I get the unknown games. I, I don't know that Demolition Racer No Exit is a big known game. Or Ace Combat, per se. Advance, at least. Okay, which controller do I want to use for this? Uh, maybe a Super Nintendo controller? I know, it's a, it's a third-party controller. Let's make sure we got the right setup here. Because this happens to me all the time. Okay. Uh, let's see here. Game Boy Toad says, I wish you'd get more than five games each box. And I wish it was twice a month for the same price. <laughs> yeah. I wish it was every day for the same price. <laughs> he says that my collection would grow faster. Jealous. Can't wait for mine. Hey, you can always uh, hit up a local retro game store and see what they got. Retro Game Treasure is fun for the mystery, but if you're looking for specific games, hit up your local retro game store and uh, see what they got. They, they always have something cool. For sure. T says, you got an treasure. <laughs> Which is, I only noticed the meat and potion. The bottom of the box is amazing. I love this service. If you want to sign up, use the code 5J. T says, Burb. Game Boy says, also the unknown games could be hidden gems. That's true. Absolutely. Like this game? I've never heard of this. So we'll see if it's any good. Campaign. Ooh. Is there something other than campaign? Huh. Oh, totally a novice. T says, Burb. Oh, I already did that. Pikachu loves pie! What's up, Pikachu Loves Pie? You blended in. Your your chat color is the same color as Game Boy Toads. Welcome, man. He says, uh, guess who's back? Back again. Hey, man. <laughs> Thanks for coming. Good to see ya. GBT says, yeah, every, but every time I go by from my retro game store, I hesitate because 
Like, what if I buy a game and then the next week I get it in my RGT? Well, uh, you can update your inventory on RetroGameTreasure.com so that you um, don't get uh, the same game in your box. Now, if your box is already shipped, then yeah, probably don't go buy something from a retro game store. But if your box hasn't shipped yet, and check your email, then go ahead and buy whatever you like. Looks like I get one choice. FC Talon. Wow, so it's trying to pull off some 3D effects here. Huh. Air to ground missile, air to surface missile. What's the difference between that? Oh, standard air to ground, tactical air to surface. A guided missile effective against ground targets. An unguided, okay, guided and unguided, okay. Divides into four air to air missiles. That sounds kind of awesome. A cluster missile. Let's try this cluster missile. All right, I'm ready to fly, baby. I think flight games are a lot of fun. I hope this is no exception. Oh, it's top down. I actually did not expect that so much. Whoa. Oh, okay. Huh. Alright, so if I hold up, it'll bring me down lower on the map. If I let go, it brings me back to level. Hitting down changes the weapon I have equipped. Okay, A is like a machine gun. B is whatever missile I have equipped. Cool, so this is like... Xevious style shooter. Okay, R is for thrust. L is maybe break? Unsure. Alright, let's get moving. Whoa! I've been shot already. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, this controller is kind of hitting up when I don't want it to. Might need to switch controllers. I get the feeling I'm not doing so good. Stop doing that. This is kind of slow for a dogfighting type game. What is that noise? Is that just like warning there's a missile incoming or is it like I'm dying? Aha! We shot down somebody, finally. Let's see if we can get whatever this is in the ground. Oops, you gotta continue to shoot, though, when you're doing that. Okay, we got one. I need to switch controllers. It's behaving kind of funny. It's a campaign, huh? I gotta say, I expect it to be a little bit more action-packed than this. Oh, mission failed. Ah, uh, Pikachu loves pie says, it's been a very long time, but I finally remembered my Twitch password. <laughs> I'm sorry you didn't remember your Twitch password. Also, my stream seems to be a little washed out. Let's change our colors down a little bit, huh? Make sure that looks good. White Ace is here! He says, eh, hey, what's up? What did you get? Okay, to recap, we got this game, uh, Ace Combat Advance. Demolition Racer No Exit on Dreamcast. Never heard of it, but it's wrapped in new. Jurassic Park on Genesis. And Super Adventure Island on Super Nintendo. I think it's a solid pile here. However, I'm not sure that this game isn't a solid pile at the moment. It's, uh, it's kind of slow. Kind of... Janky. I think I want some ground missiles. Let's go with a guided ground missile. 
GTS does not usually get games in between their selecting of games and shipping. GB2 says, hello, she loves by I'm afraid we haven't met. I'm Game Boy Toad. I'm an Instagrammer slash percussionist. Yes, he is. Yes, my, I focus exclusively on it now, Chris. Oh, okay. Uh, who drums to various meme, pop, and video game tunes and themes. Welcome, and I hope to see you in future streams. Very friendly of you. Thanks, Game Boy Toad. And he advertises himself on Instagram at Game Boy Toad. You can check out Game Boy Toad on Instagram at Game Boy Toad. Firepowered's here, what's up? Welcome, Firepowered. He says, so 5J is finally back. Yes, I am. It's Chris, can you move the logos and the face cam to the bottom of the screen? Sure can. Check that out. Is it better? Oh, I wanted to switch controllers. See if this one's better. Just one second. Different brand, a third party controller. Hopefully, this one's a little better. I need to get a first party Super Nin to Nintendo controller. To Nintendo. I can't say it apparently. Okay, let's see how this one works. Okay. Oh, hey, you want a piece of this? I'll take you out. What's up? Maybe I just had a bad run. We'll see how this run goes. There's somebody right here. Oh, I'm so gonna get you. Maybe. Nope, I'm a little lost again. L do for me. Oh, I was overusing my jets and oh nope, no, I was being shot. Never mind. All right. Oh wait, just one. Nav point one reached. Move on. What does that mean? I'm not supposed to sit here and destroy everything. Oh, I'm playing it like Xevious, and that's apparently not how it goes. Demazing is here! What's up, Demazing? Wow, good to see you, bud. Uh, let's see. What it says, no way, that game is great, Jurassic Park. Awesome, glad to hear it. I think it might be the one I remember playing as a kid, but I'm not sure. I think the Super Nintendo one is a little different than the Genesis one. Firepower says, also, Super Adventure Island is good, in my opinion. Good, good. I do like Adventure Island, so excited to see Super Adventure Island. T's back. Uh, Game Watch says, Firepowered White Ace, you don't know how much I missed you all. Ah, I missed you guys, too. A week off is too long. Firepowered says, I just got my braces done today, and I don't know why people make such a big fuss about it. It didn't hurt at all. I think uh, it hurts over time because it's going to be moving your teeth. But, uh, yeah, I, I don't know if it's going to be a big deal. Demazing says, after a while, they hurt like frick. So be prepared. So, Jay, how you been? I've been doing good, man. I've been out of commission on the stream for a little while. Well, what, like a week, actually. I don't even remember all the things that got in the way. But I'm back now. And we're streaming. We're playing our retro games. So far, not real impressed with this one, gotta say. Based on how 3D things were looking, I was like, oh yeah, it's gonna be a 3D dogfighting game. But no, it's like a weird xevious like game that's not really Xevious because... It's not really a shoot 'em up It's kind of just don't die and fly through the checkpoints and the combat isn't really all that engaging it's kind of hard to see what's going on can't see very far around you I think flight simulator games are cool but when you do a top-down perspective like this it's not a flight simulator anymore it's some sort of shoot 'em up type game and it's not doing it for me right now 
I also keep hitting the up button and diving. I'm gonna die like any second. My thruster is also keeps dying on me too. Yeah. Not digging it, gotta say. Eh, I gotta give that that game like a D or something. Oh well, let's finish or let's do some more chats here. Firepowered says this stream is in 144p for me, Lel. Really? Man, low resolution. GT says thanks. Much better. So this dude made a controller for the Super Nintendo, Super Game Boy. Still looking for one where it's a cart and you plug it into your Game Boy. There's a wire connected to the cart so you can plug it into your SNES. The Super Game Super Game Boy didn't have some sort of cable. Is this some sort of third party thing? T says, but anyways, when I was going, what I was going to say is that uh, one idea for a show is called Perfect English, since English is going crazy now. No one in the world can say some words properly because no one will understand it, and that's the point of the show. Someone says English words, as some of them should be said. I don't know how long it'll last, but I'll try to make it. Sounds um sounds interesting. I'm not exactly sure what you're going for there, but once you see it in motion, I'm sure we'll all catch on pretty quick. Everyone's exclaiming about Demazing being back, which is awesome. I'm going to plug in Jurassic Park on, Super, on Genesis here. Game Boy Toad says, I've taken your place while you've been gone, Demazing. <laughs> yeah, he's been uh, the one welcoming uh, new viewers and saying, follow me. Thanks, man. Demazing says, lol. T says, did anyone see that big message I sent? Yeah, I just read it. But I'm behind in my chats, so. Poco is home. Uh, she's not around. I'll say hi when she pops her head in if she does. Demazing says, it's been months since I saw Poco. Around seven. Seven months? I've only been streaming for like seven months. Fiberheads is getting Pokemon Moon for Christmas. That's awesome. Oh, yeah. Gotta play it on a real Genesis controller. Well, it's actually a Hyperkin Genesis controller, but it's really, really good. This Hyperkin Genesis controller is very good, so. Doo 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 doo. I'm liking that music. GBT says, Chris, your logo looks pixelated. Like you look like an NES sprite. Reload your stream. Oh, this is totally the game I remember. a little dark this time. I'll put it in the middle between where it was and where it is. Okay. Everyone is having problems with my stream? I'm not seeing any problems on my end. I don't know what's going on. Let me check in my browser here, see how it looks. My browser it's good. Try refreshing your device, guys. Game Boy this is a custom thing that turns your Game Boy into Super Game Boy controller for the any Oh oh I see. Turns your Game Boy into the controller. I see. That makes more sense now. I'm not sure if this is connected as my controller for Genesis games. Controller to player mapping. There we go. Rawr. Oh, it's the T-Rex. Oh, man. <laughs> What's up, dude? <laughs> this is pretty awesome, I gotta say. The Rex has demolished your car. The electric fences are down, and all the dinosaurs are loose on the island. Make your way through the jungle to the power station. Already this game is loads better than that last one. This is Chris, up close, in personal too. The Genesis game. Fireparts says, I recently got into Friends. Oh yeah, that's a good sitcom. 
Tamina says, wait, Game Boy Toad isn't mod yet. <laughs> Oops. Never mind, we'll skip that. Alright, oh boy, oh, oh! Okay, so you're tranquilizing these dinosaurs. They go to sleep. I got like a grenade, my goodness. What's gonna be happening with these guys? Uh-oh. Oh, it's a gas grenade, okay. I need the shocker. Okay. Whoa! Did not see that coming. Get off! Get off! Get off me! How do I get the right weapon? Alright, alright, alright. There it is, the tranquilizer. Alright, we're alive. edge of the platform. This kind of reminds me of that game I played on the stream, uh, Flashback? Do you guys remember that? Oh boy. He's after me. He's after me, Lucky Charms. They're magically delicious. Sorry. <laughs> it's a little laggy. This, I might, I might have played the Super Nintendo one. I don't remember it being so laggy. Of course, that could also be my, my poor memory as a kid. Me thinking things were better than they were. Ouch. I'm gonna mess you up. Oh! Did you see that? I did mess him up. Gotcha. Uh-oh. Can I jump on those? Okay, yeah, no problem. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ah, Game Boy Toad says, Chris actually sounded like the Lucky Charms dude. And then D Amazing says, hashtag Lucky Charms swag at 5J. <laughs> Didn't know that I wanted Lucky Charms swag, but now that I know that it's a thing, I want nothing more than that Lucky Charms swag. So it must be Grant, huh? The, the Indiana Jones knockoff guy from uh, it, Jurassic Park. Do, 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 do. Oh! Oh, we have a different weapon. What's that? The shocking thing. Oh, we've got several new weapons. Test them out. Oh, can't get up there. Whoa! Look at this guy sliding around. I wish I had moves like that guy. Do it again. Ooh, ooh, ooh! Wow, and it really makes him fly. Ooh, ooh! Apparently, the goal is to get down as low as you can. Look at the moves he got. Nobody got moves like this guy. Kind of reminds me of uh, Michael Jackson in like Moonwalker type thing. <laughs> the mostly white outfit with the hat, and the moves, the clear, wonderful dance moves. Game Boy Toad's asking if I'll explain something. I'd rather explain it offline, Game Boy Toad. Tamazing says, was it like... Super Saiyan. Never mind. Never mind. Actually, speaking of sassy, I haven't seen her in a while. Five Hearts says, it's strange because all my friends got their braces in elementary school, but now I'm 14 in 8th grade and still have two baby teeth. They'll have to be removed. Oh man, really? Eh, everyone's different. I feel like I'm repeating the same section here over and over. Just me or all of this laid out exactly the same. Get up there. 
You guys should be going up. Down appears to not work. Wow, that's quite a jump. Mario would be proud. Alright, none of this is working out for me. Ooh, ooh, ooh! Them moves, though! Them moves, though! Oh, oh, oh! Get those! Definitely get those! Okay, this is absolutely 100% repeating. We were in this exact room. What is going on? Do I have to go up? White Ace says he loves this game. White Ace, do you got some advice for me? Because I'm a little confused already. Jesus, sorry, I kind of burped there, but I was saying that I've been focusing on the Resistance Show thing mostly so far since the world is slowly freezing. By the way, this takes place in the, Resin or the Resistance 3 time. When the world was freezing, it was hard to get food, so one guy comes up with a trick to steal them from people. One guy figures it out and steals food he stole. He got angry and attacked him, and, and it's a huge fight against that guy. And the Chimera. Wow, so that's like a machinima thing that you're making there, or that's the actual story of the game? I just want to fall down, and I actually can't do it. <laughs> Unbelievable. Just go between those two platforms. Okay. Whew. Everybody get what happened there? I kind of don't. Zat! Zatarans! <laughs> Let's try to not get in that situation. Situation, yep. Situation, that's clearly the word for it. What about down here? This appears to be death. You don't want to go down there. Ah. Sit your butt down. Sit your butt down. It's going to regenerate again, isn't it? We're going to be in exactly the same place again, aren't we? That looks likely, honestly. What says, I haven't played this game since I was eight. Yeah, I'm kind of right there with you. Yeah, we saw the big chat again. I'm probably behind my chats here. Dwayne says, I was born with extra teeth, and they had to cut my gums open and take them out. Ooh, that sucks, man. No good. It's like uh, Lauren actually had six wisdom teeth instead of the usual four. I don't get how I just died there. And so she had to get six wisdom teeth pulled all at once. Kind of sucky. I had four pulled at once, and I don't know, it was fine, but six, that's a lot. Fire Parts is, oh yeah, we we're talking about stuff I don't want to put on the stream. Game Boy says, anyone want to sell me their Game Boy Pocket? Game Boy Pocket. Actually, uh, Retro Game Treasure sells consoles on their shop, and I think that they probably have a Game Boy Pocket. If not, some other retro sites that I like to use to buy stuff. Uh, DKOldies.com. DK like Donkey Kong. DKOldies.com. Um, and Lukey Games. L-U-K-I-E Games.com. Good stuff. Also, StoneAgeGamer.com. Lots of good sites. Alright, cool. I'll get you. Get you good. Eh. Gotcha. My baby is still dead, says Game Boy Toad talking about his Game Boy. <laughs> Sorry, man. Ah, uh, Fire Prince says, I don't even have one Game Boy Toad. It says, still plays games, but you can't see them, but you can hear them. Ooh, that is tragic. 
T says, I'm making stuff up. Oh, Firepower says, always, also he was a big, uh, again, talking about a conflict thing that came up, but we're just skipping. Game Boy says, Chris is making all these food references. Firepower says, this game seems cool. I think it does seem uh, fun, but there's a problem here where I was getting stuck, like, in a repeat cycle over and over again. So I hope that doesn't happen again. Ah! Get off me! Get off! Okay. I also like that you're not actually killing any dinosaurs, you're just putting them to sleep. It's like, yeah, I don't think that's exactly what you would do if you were gonna die. I need that health really bad, so I gotta get up there. Oh! They get up again? No good. Why can I not grab this ledge again? E e no. Don't know what the deal is, but it doesn't want to do it. Uh oh. No. so weird that it launches you like that. Game over? What just happened? I was just sitting there sliding on my butt with style. I'm just dead. Very strange. Huh, what? Hey Chris, I have an important question we all want to know ask you but couldn't answer because you were gone. Okay, shoot. Firepower says, also whenever you pick up a power-up, the sound sounds something like you'd hear on an in-game menu. Also, why are the wisdom teeth if they grown in a stupid position? Good point. Wow, that looks cool. Look at that level. Let's get to... Oh, T-Rex! See, a game like this has cool stuff hidden behind, like, some areas that weren't quite as well designed as others. I feel like the better version of this game might have been the Super Nintendo version, sadly. But it is pretty awesome. It's just uh, a little obtuse in parts. That one part with uh, repeating over and over and you're slipping on all the slopes. I'm baffled there. Other than that, it's a pretty fun game. Maybe a little janky. Oh, um, the I, I was teasing an announcement. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Um... I don't know that I can say anything about it yet. Sorry, guys. And it's not an amazing announcement. I said it was kind of a fun announcement. That's all. Sorry, it's been blown out of proportion. I probably teased you guys too soon because I, I didn't have a solid solid date when I would be able to announce it. Sorry. But now I have braces. I've made a new best friend. Drinkable yogurts. Amen. Gogurt baby. All about that. Actually, before we do that, what's this player business? Nothing? Okay, I was about to quit the stream, but I can be a raptor. There is no quit, not, not the stream, but I was about to quit this game, but I can be a raptor. You have broken out of the raptor cage, and you are free to roam the island. You have picked up the scent of Dr. Grant. As you stalk him through the jungle, beware of armed guards. Uh, this sounds awesome. <laughs> but he says, so what was the surprise, 5 day J, did I miss it? Nope, I'm behind on my chats. He says, but eventually he shoots the guy that stole the food he stole. My goodness. Uh, and for, for, fast forward to some other time. I don't know. He gets connected by, cornered by Grimm's. They attack him and he gets a Chimera power thing. Hale gets in res too. I'm really confused, bud. I, I don't know the story of these games. <laughs> Sorry. And now he controls a power similar to... S minus hail at the end of Res 2, but that power is also a virus, so he, 
he doesn't survive after a while the end unless I make up another thing maybe before that the guy started stealing food I don't know <laughs> alright well you make it maybe it'll make more sense when I'm seeing it in less than like a sentence worth of stuff Beverly says yeah it was a surprise sorry that dinosaur was creepy <laughs> says T Barbara says, Jay, you said you would say it. You liar triggered. Sorry. I know. Sorry, guys. I'm a bad person. Is that just a scream? That's an attack. Jump. Anything else? That's it. Are these guys good guys or bad guys? Are you my friend now or are you not? Oh! Oh, okay. Excuse me. Uh, they actually had a little voice there. Ah! T says, "Be the raptor." Five words says, "Any game that lets you play as a non-human being is a good game, right?" Totally. Oh yeah, I forgot. There's food in the ground that you can can eat. Look at him jump. Oh. Okay. You got to be a little more skillful as the raptor, I think. Ow! Can I... Can I call them to be my friends? Oh, that's a bite. That's not a call. Oops. <laughs> T says, just watch Resistance gameplay. I don't know. T-Amazing says, Jay, my NES broke and I was pissed out of all the things... The days it could have broke. Like when I had the millions of NES and PS1s. Oh yeah, that's right, you had all of those in the past. Now they're gone, huh? I thought I had three health bars. Guess not. Ah, ah. I like that this raptor like grabs onto ledges and stuff. I can just kind of bounce on him like freaking Mario and a Goomba. Get up there! Get up there! Don't die in the spikes! Don't do- Oh, whoa! We made it. Just in time, we made it. Ah! Ah! We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. T says, I'll maybe make a trailer thing soon. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. You really don't know, do you, T? But I'll need to have iMovie, which I can't get. Isn't iMovie free? Ah! Apparently I just jump on their heads and they're dead. Sounds good to me. Oh! See, that time I knew what to do. Went for him right in a row. It's easy if you do it this way. There we go. Take that. Okay. Man, look at this raptor go. He's a beast. Literally, literally a beast. Moved on, baby. You sense Grant is near. Make your way through the power station, but beware of electricity. Opposite of a human, in which case we need to be searching out electricity constantly. So we can do things like play this. Dimension says, frickin' Mario Raptor over here, right? Totally. Oh, scene change! Oh, oh, they're dropping pellets at me. Oh boy. I can't really duck. So I just have to not jump. Whoa, what a jump. Also, he's like Kung Fu. Kung Fu Raptor. Flying through the air with them kicks. Got me. Oh, no, I wanted to stay up there. See if there's anything in that box. That jump is nuts. Okay, box is nothing. Hey. What was that? <gasps> I found a new attack! 
It's also one for holding up. Nope. If I hold down and then hit the uh, foot attack, he does a pounce! It's also good for crossing gaps. Do I get to eat people? Eating people sounds okay. No! No! Yikes. Oh, that was it. Game over. Don't do it. Don't do it. Well, that was cool. I like that game. After I played as the raptor, I, I got away from there with a much, much better impression. I'll give that one a solid B. That was pretty cool. Demusing says, Haha, those puns, though. Firepart says, I have seven Mario Maker levels. Nice. He says, seven. Grr. I don't understand. Demusing says, Kung Fu Mario Raptor. That eats Lucky Charms all the time. Lucky Charms swag. <laughs> They're magically delicious. <laughs> Let's try Super Adventure Island. All right. That part says, what's so bad about seven? T. It says, not D. Not and D. Seven grand. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, this is a Super Nintendo game. You don't want to play that with a Genesis controller. Let's try this Super Adventure. Super Adventure. Wow. Looking at the word Super Adventure. <laughs> Super Nintendo controller. Boom. Ooh, those graphics, though. They're so beautiful already. Looks a little bright. Let's turn them down again. Whoa! Did he just turn her to stone? Uncool, bro! Yeah. It's time to kick some butt. Oh! <laughs> He's just like, alright, pick me up, boy. He's just got, like, this posse of... of, uh, crazy animals on his side. What's going on? Not... Set up for Super Nintendo? Must not be. SNES. Okay. Try this again. Hudson, these are the guys that make Bomberman. Well, did. Unfortunately, Hudson is... Wow. That's, that's a big, nice-looking sprite. All right, yeah. It's a nice-looking game so far. Yeah, this is a lot like Adventure Island, but super. Yes, get on that skateboard, baby! Oh, look at him with his helmet for safety. Oh, and a boomerang. Yeah, nice. Good call. Ooh, there goes the skateboard. Ooh, I'm tripping over everything. I'm not paying attention to my feet. Is that a dragon ball? Get the dragon ball! Chris, did you get my big message? I don't see a big message. Probably missed you out there. It says, bam, and Chris does the Lucky Charms thing perfectly again. <laughs> Grand dad? Reason says right, Fleenstones. Oh, I did watch that uh, that video last time. I forgot to watch it on stream, but I watched it after. Did, wait, was, did I watch it after or on? Oh, I watched I watched the one that was making uh, it was a uh, uh, you're a kid, you're a squid version of it off stream. I forgot to watch it on stream. Well, I got super powered up. Uh, Boomerangs. Well, I did. And now I don't. Oh, 
All right. We got this. I'll tell you, this game looks really nice. There's some big, beautiful sprites. Oh, we must have got a bunch of those upgrades last time. Look at this. I felt like Super Adventure Time, or Adventure Time, Adventure Time. <laughs> this has nothing to do with Adventure Time. Super Adventure Island. I feel like Adventure Island, oh, that was a bad jump. I feel like Adventure Island was like, uh, non-stop. Like you were just going, going, going. Is that, am I remembering that incorrectly? I might be remembering that incorrectly. Okay. That was sad. Sorry, I've died already. Hashtag 5J get good. I'm liking that music. It's got a nice bass line. Oh, I forgot. It's kind of one hit, you're dead. I was like, hey, no problem. I'll just run into this B thing. No, nah, it's a problem. Don't run into the B thing. Gotcha. I like his face as he's throwing it. He's like, Aah! Come on, jump extra high. All right. I'm kind of curious if this one's a little off, too. I feel like he's doing things I don't want him to do. Switch it out for a third controller. And if that doesn't work, we can use the Retron 5 controller. This one's identical to the last one. Sometimes they're just made wonky. You never know. Checking out these chats. Man, where has Silent been? Oh yeah, Silent said he was looking forward to the stream tonight, and where is he? Hang on, where is his port? Okay, there it is. Uh, let's see. Granddad, all the granddad. Chris, do you want a big message? I don't think so. They said, I think not. Seven Granddad was a bootleg game a guy played and turned it into a meme. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. Game Boy Hints, I introduced Chris to that meme last week. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, wow, lots of chats. You're, you're a grand, you're a dad. <laughs> I mean, now you're a granddad, now you're a dad. Play for 30 minutes. Wow, Jay, your stream is going weird now. It's going weird? What does that mean? I don't know if I like it going weird on me. White Ace Jr. says this game reminds him of Mario. Hey, that's kind of cool. What just happened? This doesn't remind me of Mario all that much. I got a super hidden secret, and then failed to do anything with it. That was kind of sweet, though. White Ace Jr., by the way, thanks for watching, bud. Your dad's a cool guy. He keeps me company. I'm really digging this music. Oh, snap, little guy got me. Apparently, I really need to get good here, because I've been dying way too much. I'm a little ashamed of my life right now. <laughs> Look at that face! Yeah! Covers up his whole face with his throwing animation. No, no, that was a bad choice. You're, you better eat food, or you know what's going to happen. You'll starve. Game Wizard says, Did you see that? I didn't see whatever. Nope. By her friends and her, but every time I looked in the corner of my eye, she was staring at me and blushing. Oh, this must be something about that girl. 
you were uh, you were talking about a girl that you weren't sure if she liked you or not. Uh, we didn't get the first part of that, so break that first part into two parts as well. Because right now that second part is completely out of context and it's not going to make any sense to me. And I'll go back and I'll read the second part afterwards. Okay, get good, get good. Yes, now look at that boomerang. Alright, now it has uh, the motion of the little hammer. Alright, yes, get good, get good. Okay, we're holding it together. So far. Okay, this is where we died before. Careful, careful, careful. I meant to jump there and it didn't seem to go. Alright, now there was like a hidden secret like right here. It must be already consumed, huh? Guess so. Okay. It is what it is, folks. Oh, I think I must have hit a checkpoint. I feel like I'm further than before. Further than the last time I died, rather. Yes! Finally got rid of those guys easy. I don't know why I didn't see that coming. Totally didn't see that coming. <laughs> wow, we really need to get good, guys. Let's start this over. Super Adventure Island! That was crazy. Firepower says 5J, more like meme J. Ho ho ho! <laughs> Game Boy Hood's gonna try and whisper the thing to me, okay? You sent it? it? I didn't see it in my DMs either. I mean, I can check on my app. Yeah, I don't have any DMs in here. Five parts says the Gen 7 starter trio is the best starter trio. Oh, really? You know, I have not got Sun or Moon yet, unfortunately. Sorry to say. Is it just me, or is this, like, stuttering kind of bad? Alright, skateboard. Let's see if we can hold on to the skateboard. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, no! Can't do it. Too much of a noob. Ah, I still tripped and died. Well, actually, I landed on the pointy part. That's not good. You don't want to do that. At least this music is pumping me up. Pump, pump the jam. Okay, I do that too much in this stream. <laughs> Sorry, folks. Super outdated reference. Not as okay. Once again, I'm thinking like I can hit these guys. What is that meter on the top? Because that doesn't appear to be health. Is that a hunger meter? Do I die if I don't eat fruit as well? It's not a health meter, but it I guess it does still mean you die if it's empty. I can only assume. Lots of things kill you in this game. Lots of things. Whoa! <laughs> Almost got me. Oh! Rocks. There, get the Dragon Ball. Oh, you meant my Instagram DMs. Oh shoot, my Instagram is... Actually, what is it? It's like, just not working. Like, that's it. I think I have to restart. I think I have to restart my phone here. It's like, stuck installing, but it won't install. It's weird. Chris, I sent in DMs on Instagram. Okay, cool. Okay, Game Boy Toad says, does Chris know about PPAP? Yes, yes I do. <laughs> I have a pen. 
I have pineapple. There was one. <laughs> so mostly, uh, yeah, it's just a silly song, right? I saw one that was a, a heavy metal version. <laughs> I found that one kind of hilarious. The original one is weird, for sure, and worth a, worth one view just to go, what is wrong with some people? <laughs> um, but uh, I preferred that heavy metal version much more. Okay, okay, so far we're on a roll. Let's keep it up. Okay, that's working real good. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Look at me go. So far. He almost chucked it and I could feel my death coming. Yes! Dragon Ball number two! Game Boy, this is Chris, new meme, congrats! I have a Raichu, I have a surfboard. Uh, Alolan Raichu, oh man, I don't... I don't know what any of the Alolan forms look like. You can't read my DM, no, let me see if my phone is restarting yet. He says, okay, there's someone at my school who always talks about inappropriate stuff, and I assume whatever he is saying is something weird. I guess he must have been confused about the PPAP thing. Uh, Firepowered says, White Ace, I haven't played Sun Moon, but I'm getting it for Christmas. T says, I have a camera, I have a funny thing, boom. Internet meme. That's kind of how it goes. That's a meme and a meme right there. That's a meme about memes right there. That's what that is. Whoa! Whoa! I dodged it, though. Look at me dodging things. I feel like there's a little bit of chug in this game, which actually might be helping me out, honestly. Help things go a little slower for me, because apparently... I need to get good. Oh, burn to a crisp! Alright, starting from basics. Just a little tomahawk. Single tomahawk. Here's your double tomahawk. Beep, beep, beep. Oh, I could have beat it this whole time. Down the hill. Yeah, okay. Look at me go. Look at me go! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh, please don't kill me. I'm too young to die. <laughs> Whoa! I could not get down that hill very fast. I thought I could turn around pretty quick. I was wrong. I'm really digging this music, man. They got a good thing going there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Get away! <laughs> Woo! Little guy almost got me. Oh, they're deadly! Why are there so many? Ah! I'm gonna die, I have hunger. Okay, we made it. Just barely. Get the pineapple. And the kiwi. Don't forget kiwi. Kiwi's delicious, by the way. Anyone anyone here like kiwi? Get a shout out for kiwi. What is happening? Why can I not jump over that now? What? There you go, super jump. That was not worth- Hey, we, it was worth it! We win! Dragon Ball number three. Wadi says to Firepower, the game is great. Also, Midnight Release was awesome. So many cool and nice people. Isn't that so true, though? I've always had great experiences with Midnight launches of stuff. <gasps> 
Ooh, first boss. I think I have to hit his little... Oh! Didn't see that coming. Oops. We have to start over from here? Fine. You know, this is when Mom says you have to wait till Christmas to get Sun and Moon, but no, you'll see spoilers if you don't get it now. Not really for me, because my parents won't ever buy a Pokemon game. I'm lucky I got gold. Sorry, dude. Everyone's different. Some parents are like, eh. Fireheart says, apart from the official trailers, I try to steer clear of uh, Sun and Moon spoilers until I get the game. Me too. Game of says, is it turning on five viewers? Seven viewers is what I see, by the way. Thanks for watching, folks. I don't see anyone in here that I don't recognize, so... T says, just thought of something. Say this fast. Meme and a 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 meme. Game says, does Chris know about Rick rolling? Oh, come on. My generation invented Rick rolling. Come on, you gotta know that much at least. That's where you get memes. That and IGN. Thanks, reaction guys. There we go. I gotta time this better. There's a way to get these guys. Oh! I just am no good at it. Oh, yeah. There you go. Figure out their pattern and their toast. Or, you can be really bad, and then you're toast. <laughs> ah! <sighs> okay. You've got very little time left. Get the fruit! Nope. No, no, no. Game Boy Toast is honestly scared of this box. I turn off my likes for all categories, you know, so I can complete my Game Boy collection faster with more categories, so I can force myself to try new games. T says, I haven't eaten kiwi in years. Me either, actually. But, uh, last time I did, I sure loved it. I know, I know. I'm getting low on, on fruit. Okay. Bow, bow, da, da. Okay, now we know this leads to a boss. We should definitely take a save state here, just in case. You know, this. I like fr my friend Kiwi, Kiwi the Kiwi. He's visited here before. Remember him? We were gonna stream Smash. Oh yeah, yeah. I remember you just streaming Smash with somebody. I don't remember their name being Kiwi the Kiwi though. Whoa. That was a really high flame. Whitey says, Whitey Jr. had a good time trading with people and battling people. His highlight of the night was getting a shiny Venusaur. What? A shiny Venusaur? That's awesome. Who wants this Pokemon Go child? Whitey says, Firepower, no worries, none for me. He says, I forgot Whitey Jr. went to the room that night release. Did he enjoy it? Sounds like he did. Firepower's leaving. See ya, man. Thanks for coming. T says, if you didn't know Rickroll, Granddad, Troll, Face, or especially the word meme, stay off the internet. Give it to this, Chris. Did your phone turn back on? Yes, it did. Thanks for checking back in, because I would totally forget. Insta what? It's still installing its update. Oh, wait. It might actually be working this time. It's, like, installing and uninstalling. Do I, like, not have enough space? No, I've got 1.7 gigs. Very str I don't know what's going on, man. This started earlier today, and I thought, eh, I'll leave it alone and it'll fix itself. Apparently not. Oh, uh, excuse me, those ghosts were not a threat until just then and there. Uncool. T says, bye to Firepowered. Wise says to Yomotoad he had a blast 
but the only eight-year-old there got some cool free stuff. Uh, four posters, two sets of pins, a bunch of stickers. That's super awesome, man. Nice, white ace sounds cool and fun, says Game Boy Toad. Yes, that does sound awesome. Can't imagine being eight and, and having that experience. That's awesome. Wait for people to be cool sometimes. Is he dead? Is he dead? Is he dead? There we go. He wasn't so hard. We only lost three little things for food. T has to go. See you, T. Thanks for coming. Well... Oh, wait, it says updated. Maybe it worked. Okay, 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 here we go, here we go. I thought, once again, it's installed, but when I click on it, nothing's happening. Why you have to be so weird? Maybe I had it open. Let's close everything. I have a lot of things open! Also, I should probably be done with this game, shouldn't I? Move on to my last game of the night. This was a cool game. I'm liking this game. There was a little bit of maybe some wonkiness or whatever. So, uh, I don't know. I really dug the music, though, and I think there's a good core there. Doesn't feel quite as high quality as a Nintendo game. Um... But it was pretty good. I'd give that one a B plus. Super Adventure Island was pretty cool. Let's see. Game Boy Toad. Sadly, I missed out on the whole Pokemon uh, card craze and game craze as a child, which is sad considering an old friend of mine, of my childhood, is a Pokemon addict. He had all the toys, almost all the games, besides the original Game Boy games. Watched the show every chance he got, and always played black and white constantly, and had Pokemon bed sheets and everything. I only knew what a Pikachu was because of him, and that's all I learned as a child. Wow. Well, and the good news of that, though, is that the sense of discovery is you're playing them, so... Good and bad. Hey, finally it opened. Okay. I am going to go switch out now and try that Dreamcast game. Actually, let's get it open first, because it's brand new. Demolition Race No Exit. Do I have anything here to help me open this? Let's try whatever this thing is. I think it's a bottle opener. Not exactly meant for... Hey, it still works, though. <laughs> Pro tip, use a bottle opener to open plastic on games. Yes, I am not a collector, so I don't care. Well, practical collector. What I mean by practical is I play all the games I collect. Unless, for some reason, it was really rare and I didn't care about it. Yeah, it's new as new gets right there. I'm going to pop this in, guys. i got to move some stuff out of the way to do it. i got to switch my input. Ugh. Okay. Sorry, guys. Working on it. Whew. Okay. Oh, I don't know why. It keeps losing the date and time on me, but I just turn it off. As you would do with a video game system. I imagine you're not supposed to do this every time you power it on. So let's see. 11-22-2016. That was 8-45. Then 
Okay. Let's play it up. Okay, give us you'd be surprised. Aren't you surprised, Chris? This is the one stream since the few since a few retro game treasure boxes ago that I haven't mentioned that one game's name. Yes. Thank you. Appreciate that. Aren't you proud of me, lol? Yes, very proud. <laughs> oh, here it is. Uh, did you close all your apps and try to reopen the app? Yes, it's finally open and I can read it now. Whitey says, I will say that I was worried about not having gym leaders, but I am really having a good, good time with it, and I already have 30 hours on moon. Holy crap! Whitey's Jr. has 15 on his. Man, that's awesome. This looks funny. Oh yeah, a little metal action. Collision is certain. Collision is certain. Collision. Collision. It's only a matter of when. As long as everyone follows the rules and is considerate of others, we can relax and enjoy driving. <laughs> enjoy driving. Enjoy driving. Enjoy driving. <laughs> Without rules, the unexpected can be trouble. <laughs> That was an awesome montage. That was really cool. <laughs> uh, let's keep catch up on our chats though, and get to this one. Turn the audio back down a bit. Beauties of your battle of with Junior yet? Uh, also, what uh, did you get, Moon? And, and he got Sun. When the Dreamcast still thinks it's 1998, haha, what does he think is going on Pokemon releasing in America right now? Yeah, yeah, 1998. Whitey says, yeah, I got Moon, he got Sun. I didn't tell him he got it until the guy handed me two copies. Uh, I haven't battled him yet. I'll be doing some training with him, try to make some of the upcoming challenges easier for him. He says, Chris, what's the highest year it goes up to? I don't know. It takes too long to change for me to test it. Well, he says, that is classic, Game Boy Toad says, this has to be the funniest game opening ever. Enjoy driving, enjoy driving, enjoy driving, enjoy driving, enjoy driving. Yeah, that was really funny. All right, finally going to get to Game Boy Ch uh, Toad's old chat here. He says, also, Chris, I may have developed a crush on a girl at school. She likes to glance over at me in class and at lunch. I've DM'd her in no reply, but she's read them, and she knows I've sent them yesterday. She ran into me and said hi to me, and I smiled, and, and I said hi back. Didn't get further than that yesterday. And today in class, one of her friends said to come over to their to their table and talk about something and mentioned her. One of my best friends happens to sit at their table, so I walked over and went. On this old chat. So I walked over and went by her friends and her, but every time I looked in the corner of my eye, she was staring at me and blushing. I don't know if she likes me though. One of her best friends is a friend of mine, and we were talking about her, and she tried to help. I really like her, but I'm like antisocial and have a hard time even approaching women I like. That's why I played it safe with DMing because, duh, I'm an Instagrammer. But she won't reply, and people think I'm sliding into her DMs. Well, you gotta work up the courage, man. I know it's scary. I've been there. I've been young. I've been shy. You gotta do it. You just gotta try it. The more that you're able to, the more that you like force yourself to do it, the less nervous you get. So, let's try it. Let's try it. We are gonna start a race here. Is it a race? What is it? I don't even know. Demolition or no exit? Demolition it is. This appears to be licensed music, but I don't recognize it. <laughs> so this is a little dark, huh? Oh man, that's so much better. Also, Chris, it's a different girl. Oh, this is a different girl! Oh! Oh boy, now you got a heart divided right there. Because I'm scared of rejection and her just saying, leave me alone or something. 
Well, either she rejects you and you uh, don't get to hang out with her, or you don't do anything and you don't get to hang out with her. At least if you try, you'll know if it was going to work out or not. Ah. Uh, you technically didn't say it. Why did she leave and see you, man? Thanks for coming. Oh my goodness, is this a hatchback? The Destroyer? Mantis? This is like a, an old cop car. That's cool. Cruiser. That's like a Pontiac GTO. Raven? That looks like a Porsche. Marauder. It's like a Challenger, I think. I think I'm gonna go with the Cruiser. Alright, let's have a demolition derby. I don't think that other girl likes me, but this was the first time I saw a girl and I instantly knew that I love this girl. Aw, that's awesome, man. Just gotta try it. Just gotta go for it. Do you hear that, that Dreamcast going crazy loading on that disc? Three, eh, two, eh, eh, eh. One, go. Okay, so it is a racing game. This much we know now. Ooh, that's a behind-view camera. Ooh, first-person mode. All right, well, this is fast and arcadey, but it's nice and smooth. I like that. Oh, <laughs> kind of slippery slidey, like I was saying, arcadey feel to it. I feel like I've pulled into first place pretty easily there. So I think I'm in first. Yeah, one out of 16. See my car. Okay, left tri Oh, what is that? Bonus points? Is it a weapon or something? Whoa! There's a health meter. So apparently you can smash each other to bits, but right now, there's no call for it. I am so far ahead of them, it's not even funny. Just wasting these guys. Oh, and there's different levels of view. Okay, so there's like really zoomed out, kind of right behind, and then like really right behind, and then really, really right behind. And then first person. I kind of like it in first person. Oh, hit the hay bales. Ah! And here I go, switching back to third person. I don't feel a lot of resistance in the off-road. It's not, not a real realistic feel there. But again, going for that arcade experience. What's that? What's that? What's that? Oh, I missed it. What's that? Whoa! Big old jumps. What's that? What's that? Oh, what's that? Plane. There's a bunch of different colored boxes there, but I don't seem to be getting any power-ups or anything. Never mind! There was a boost! My goodness, that must have come from one of them boxes, huh? Can I, like... Oh! A button is power slide! Okay. Oh, sweet. So we're getting some air. We can do some power sliding. Yeah, bonus. That was just points. Oh! Ooh. Unfortunately, somebody actually got in front of me. Get out of here. Fool. I got electricity going? Oh, I'm like invulnerable maybe? Or maybe I hurt them when I touch them? More than usual. Okay. Alright, we're back in first. Pretty solid now. White seems to be just points. I think red was the one that had a boost. Was it green that had that electrical shock thing going? That's why I'm so deathly terrified to be rejected. Oh, it's going to be okay, man. I promise. There's going to be lots of girls you're going to feel this way for. The trick is to not just leave it inside and never do anything with it, or you'll never know. She could have been your girlfriend and if you just asked. You know. So you got to try it. 
Oh, and it gives you, like, GoldenEye ratings. What did I get? Most kills? But I didn't... I got a kill? Also, this medal, though. <laughs> Most suicidal, fastest hit. Okay. Interesting. So it's just a single race. Looks like there's like a, some sort of career. It's two-player mode. That's nice. League. Let's start a league, baby. 5G, that's me. Country or arena? Ooh. Let's go for arena. Okay. Placed at least second in each race. Wow, Game Boy Toad, look at all these chats going crazy. So to uh, to be more like we're talking in person, I tried adding her on Snapchat, especially since we're starting Thanksgiving break tomorrow, but she hasn't added me back. I noticed earlier when I added her, I looked over and she showed a guy at her table her Snapchat, kind of blush, and then cutely, if I do so, add, giggled. Oh, uh, side note, Chris, I don't believe you've ever seen my percussive videos. I did see one, yeah, absolutely. You should check out my most recent bit in the stream, and without reading the comments on it, try to guess what the meme, what meme the song is from. And the thing that probably won me over to thinking she's the one was that on a dress-up day, she dressed up as a Mario. She has to like Nintendo. No girl at my school likes Nintendo. That's a sure sign that she could be the one. She was so cute dressed up as Mario. What's wrong with me? This is the first time I've ever called a girl cute. Well... Nothing's wrong with you, man. You're just growing up. That's awesome. I'm, gl I'm glad to see that uh, you find somebody. You like her. She's uh, a Nintendo fan. Now you have to talk to her. You gotta talk to her, dude. Do you hear that thing? It's so loud. Three, two, one, go! What? Oh, we're just hitting each other. Just straight up. Well, if that's the case, then I want to get into big old third person. Whoa! They didn't have this view in any other... Wow, so what, I just have to be the last one alive? This is a little too floaty for an actual... Oh, T-Bone! For an actual demolition derby, if you've ever been to one. Ooh, it looks like we died. Ah, placed third. I think demolition derbies in real life are really awesome, but... That was a little floaty and weird for a demolition derby for me. I'm, I'm not sure like this one as much as the actual racing. Gamer says, I hope she likes Nintendo. I hope she didn't just dress up as a as him because she knows who he is. But gosh dang, it might be... She might be my Poco. Well, let me set this expectation for you. Very rarely is the person that you first have a crush on the person that she actually end up spending the rest of your life with. So, I mean, if it doesn't work out, no, there will be more. There will be more. I love the ridiculous over-the-top metal. I think we did worse that time. Also, Chris, I dare you to get Poco again. Start yelling, Lauren, Lauren, get down here. Actually, up here in this case. There's a huge spider. I need your help killing it. I'll get her next time. Also, we're, at this point, we do it too often. It's going to be like crying wolf. She's going to know. Uh, I'm not liking the demolition mode. I'm going to go back to racing. Has a slight Mario Kart type feel. 
right, so I'm gonna go to New League. Country League this time. Let's try... That was the one that looked like a Porsche. Oh, it's actually not in this one. I'm gonna go with the Destroyer, the Hatchback. It'd be a very funny prank. Please, this will be the best prank. Oh, it will not. not. We'll get her next time. We'll get her next time. Don't worry. Actually, uh, the biggest spider I've seen around our place was outside. We, uh, we have a Three, deck. Two, one, and uh, part of the deck is enclosed uh, as a porch. And... Um, on the outside of the enclosed area, there is a giant spider web and a spider just chilling in there. And I called him a, a big hairy spider, and so then I named him Harry. So then whenever we go out there and we see the giant web, he's always sitting in the same spot. He's alive. He's just waiting for a victim. So we just say, hey, what's up? What's up, Harry? How's it going, man? Whoa, there's that boost. Oh! oh, oh. oh! Okay, yeah, that was kind of cool. Yeah, this game is way better in race mode than demolition mode. Way, 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 way better. It made a demolition derby seem boring in demolition mode. Which is tragic. If you've ever seen a demolition derby, it is anything but boring. It is just noise and twisting metal and breaking everything it's so loud it's like a rock concert if uh the instruments were beating each other up while playing music <laughs> and it was just instruments no people oh 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 fail repeated fail I'm missing all the upgrades where are all the upgrades there's very few out there. I right, gotta get at least second. There we go. Whoa! Flew over all those upgrades. Come on, get him. There's a hit. Another hit. We got it! We got it! The racing is easy, but at least it's entertaining. You haven't killed it. No, we left it alive. Harry the spider, we left him alive out there. Wow, look at how mangled I am. Also, listen to that bass in the background. Oh man, we got a DJ spinning. <laughs> oh man. This is what music sounded like in the 90s, maybe early 2000s as well. Save the league, why not? I'm in first. Let's keep going. Oh, actually. It is kind of past our time, isn't it, sadly? Well, I should probably actually quit, guys, unfortunately. We're going to wait till this loads, we're going to pause it. We're going to do a recap of all the games we got. Call it a night. You hear that thing loading? My goodness, it's so loud. Also, this is a very lame vehicle. <laughs> a little hatchback. Look, I said I was going to pause and stop, and I didn't. What's wrong with me? 25 hits. Also, we have points for the hit, sure. Points or maybe damage. Looks like it's probably points. Oh, that was a power up. It was just an exploding box. Uh oh. Oh boy, our wheels are shaking. We're in bad shape. Woo! Jump off road. Apparently, they hide explosives just outside the track. Yikes! 
Well, this point, it's something. And we gotta see what's down here. At any price. Is that what we Boost, maybe? Kill the car. Cool, cool. 11 out of 15 minutes. Oh, holy! We did get an upgrade there, didn't we? Oh, we did! Alright, this time we actually do have to call it. Quit. Alright guys, thank you so much for being here. Uh, let's get a, a close-up on me again here. Oh, good. We'll have some play-out music. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, guys, thanks for coming. We got, in this month's Retro Game Treasure box, Ace Combat Advance for Game Boy Advance, Jurassic Park on Genesis, I should probably give you a recap of what I thought, too. Hang on. One of them's still in the Retron. Okay. Ace Combat Advance from Game Boy Advance. I didn't really like this game. It was like a, a shoot-em-up that wasn't really a shoot-em-up. It was like a flight sim that wasn't really a flight sim. Maybe I just didn't get how to play it, or maybe there was a different mode. I didn't see anything that was intriguing to me. I gave this game a D. Jurassic Park on Genesis. I enjoyed this game. I had fun. I was uh, a little baffled at one part when I was playing a Dr. Grant, and I almost quit. And then I said, hey, what's this option do? And then I could play as a freaking raptor. And then it was awesome again. So I gave this game a B. That was awesome. Then I played Super Adventure Island on the Super Nintendo. This one, it was a fun game, it was uh, really nice looking graphics, the music was really cool, it was basically one song, but at least it was a very catchy song. But, there was a little bit of chug, things were maybe a little bit wonky with the platforming and the way things felt, but overall it was a fun game and I gave this a B+. Then we had Demolition Racer, which you just saw, uh, No Exit. And uh, I liked this much better as a racer than as an actual demolition derby sim. The, uh, the race is um, much more arcadey. There is a very sparse upgrade mechanic like Mario Kart where you can get like a boost or an electrified thing or just some bonus points. I don't do the points do because you're going by rank, so I don't know why you would want points, but whatever. Overall, I thought it was a decent game. Uh, a decent arcade racer. I bet it'd be fun as a two-player game. I'm probably going to give this one maybe a C or a C+. Plus. We'll call it a C. I'll call this one a C. I think it was a fun game. I didn't blow my, my hair back, but uh, I would definitely play this again as a racer and not as a demolition derby sim. Anyways, guys, thanks so much for coming. Uh, that was my Retro Game Treasure box for November. If you're interested in the service, go to RetroGameTreasure.com. You can use the code 5J and get a discount on your subscription. I will see you guys tomorrow. I believe I will have Wife Wednesday. I have not had anything make me believe there won't be Wife Wednesday tomorrow. So I think it will be Wife Wednesday. The rest of the week is a little weird because uh, Thanksgiving's on Thursday, but then there's also other family stuff going on. I'll see if I can throw together a schedule and put that on my Twitch dashboard or channel. Um, keep your alerts on so you'll know when I go live, too, because it'll probably be at odd times. Thanks so much for being here, guys, and uh, hopefully I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, everyone.